Kateko Boxing League started some weeks, a uh, few days ago. But here we are. Don't forget, after Ikorodu, we are still going to other parts of Lagos. Agege, Egbeda, Akomojo, Mushin, Oshodi. And let me, this Kateko Boxing League is not going to end here. We are still taking it to other parts of Lagos so that we discover more talent. Ladies and gentlemen, the battle will begin now between Abdurrahman Wahab and Habiodun Oluwatobi. I must to commend my co-commentator here, George Gift, who has done a thorough job for this commentary because uh, we have witnessed four pounds now. Me. But now, this is another Run. bout between yeah. Abdurrahman Wahab and Abiyodu Oluwatobi. Want to know my name? My name is Sonny Akitoye. I'm a commentator along with uh, uh, George. Gift George here yeah, in Ikoroji. Let's see and see what is going to happen here. Yeah. This is another cracker. And uh, the two boxers are now trying to outdo each other. And you can see what is happening here. Yeah. And a punch almost hit the, uh, how do I say it, uh, Abiyodu there. Uh, it's uh, Abraham Wahab there. But uh, you can see Abraham try to uh, ensure that uh, he kicks his opponent. And that is uh, uh, Ab uh, uh, Abraham there. And uh, you can see Abiyodu Oluwatobi doing everything. To subdue his opponent. Can you go higher with this thing? But let's see. The battle is still on between the both boxers. The fans are supporting uh, their boxer here. But let's see. It's going to be now. What a punch there. But the referee says no. You have to restart again. And uh, fans are still sharing their boxer. Oh! Another punch here. But almost fell down there. But uh, the guy backs on his feet again. I'm talking about uh, Abiyodu Oluwatobi. Let's see how Abiyodu Oluwatobi will cage his opponent. And Abdurrahman Wahab, who, are in, who is in a yellow outfit, is trying to look where he can get his opponent. And a punch throw there. And uh, the two boxers hold each other. But the referee said, a uh, play on there. But let's see how it's going to be. And uh, you can see the two boxers try to guide each other. And uh, this is a very tactical. And get there. Oh, what a point here. Yeah. But it misses him. But let's see.
see how the uh, Abiodun Lua Tobin is trying to push and trying to look how where he can get his opponent. Well, what a point here. But uh, the, his opponent, uh, that is uh, Abdurrahman, is trying to dodge it. And you can see it's now a big gang of fear now. Both are punching each other, but uh, the, decision, the decision lies on the referee. But I'm just giving you what is really happening here. And there's a good point here from the Habiyod Oluwatobi and the referee trying to uh, manage the situation. Let's see how it's going to be now. Now you can see Habiyod now and Wahab now. Now Habiyod is trying to point, but if his opponent dodges it and the referee says, you can still continue. Don't forget, we are seeing the round one of this great encounter between Abraham Wahab and Abiyodu Oluwatobi. Now, you can see now. You can see the Abiyodu Oluwatobi there. And the round one just yeah, seen it now. Ah, George, that is so far so good now. We just finished the round one. But the way I'm seeing it, it seems that Abiyodu Oluwatobi has a slight air. Upper hand over his opponent. And do you see Abiyo Dodwatobi? Ah, imagine winner at the end of this second. Too early to call. Still a long way to go in this bout. End of the first round, but we're still so close from both boxes. Let's see what dines out in the rounds to come. to be discovered, to be harnessed, of course, to make a name for themselves. And of course, also go as far as winning the big prize money, 20 million naira at stake for the best boxing club. Of course, the most valuable boxer also gets 300,000 naira. And it's still Abdul Wahab Abdul Rahman against Abiodu in this 3.5 kilogram fight. Not so much from the first round, but we're hoping for a better fight in the second round. They're still trying to size themselves from the second round. But can they bring out their very best now? With some straight, wayward jabs. Not well executed that time. But these guys are fighting like animals, I tell you. Fierce, energy serpent, gruesome fight. They're trying to pin him to the ropes. I'd be able to Very spooky boxes, these ones. They have the quite great balance. They have the power punches. Oh, that one, she really hurt. Almost like a low blow that time. They try to pin the man on the ropes. They try to pin the other to the ropes that time, but he was able to wriggle out at the critical moment. Time sticking away in the second round. It's going to give the judges a lot of work to do in terms of deciding who wins this one. Because both boxers coming out with the same tactics, the same, just doing some fierce fights. But they need to be more precise in the execution of their punches. They need to be more precise in landing the jabs and the hooks. And also their footwork, they need to step aside so that you can create an opening and land the Vanita punches. It's still Abdul Wahab, Abdul Rahman against Abiodu. 
both bouts of the night. And Abdulhab now looking good. The stick can really dominate the fight. Some body shots now. But lacking some consistency, both boxes. That's one thing about boxing. If you land the first punch, you need to follow up with a one-two. Either a jab or a hook. Or maybe just probably go for an uppercut, which will knock off your opponent off the foot. Where will this one swing? It's only to be a brawl at times. But it's a fight clean boxing. It's almost a wrestling match at times. I'm making a job for the <laughs> Johnny. Quite difficult to watch. One more round to go to the side of winner, which is Abdul Abdurrahman. Second tech of boxing league. Right side go to Ottawa. Ready to go for the third and final round. It's been a glorious night of boxing. Right, Shane Kurodu. Be quite entertaining and quite enjoyable too for the fans. And of course, it's all about discovering boxes for Nigeria. It's all about going to every city, going to every nook and corner. These boxers train every day, but they don't have the right platform. They don't have the right exposure, but that's what you could tackle boxing league. Gives to those words. And now these boxers know the time is not in their favor. If they want to win this one, if they want to get points for their club side, they need to finish up and finish up in style. Some one-two combinations now coming from Abiodu. But Abdul Wahab trying to fight back. Yet again, trying to pin him to the ropes. Close, clearly contested fight, this one. Evilly matched. Little can separate them. Makes the job so difficult for the judges. Not be surprised if it will be a split decision. Trying to pin him to the ropes again. He fights himself out of the rope yet again, Abiodu. A boxing league is started from the National Stadium and still has much more places, much more communities to scout for boxers. Various eight boxing clubs to be precise, with 16 boxers. 16 boxers per club and so every fight you step out of the ring you're trying to get a point for your team as Razak stepped out from that one that time time ticking away they need to make it decisive they need to make it quick they need to make the points in count for the judges Bruce Summit turns out to be sometimes oh he missed that uppercut Looking like a street brawl sometimes. Looking like a city fight, this one. Time ticking away. They need to come out with something big and something huge. It's the third and final round now. Almost oh, into a wrestling fight at times. Abdul Wahab and Abiodu coming to you live. Kotsi, you can tackle boxing league. And of course, you can hashtag it all over. 
wherever you see this, on every social media platform, Facebook, Twitter, just spread the word, spread the message that you can take a boxing league, season one, and how will season two be if season one is coming out is huge. And one thing about this boxing league is for the fact that most of them will get to turn professional in the future. As Abdul Wahab was going for the upper court that time, but missed all of that. The referee not too impressed. Because most of the time they turn this fight to a wrestling fight. It's a boxing match. You need to score. You need to hit at the right place at the right time and make it clean. Time ticking away. There with this one swing. Turn and final round and that will do it. That will do it between Abdul Wahab and Abiyodun. Who comes out victorious? The judges will tell us. We'll wait for the official decision.